Good morning you fine human beings. It is Tuesday and I haven't vlogged for a week. So yeah, please excuse this. This. It seems I'm breaking out and I never break out. I'm blaming you little baby. Um, so yeah, I haven't vlogged in a week. Liam actually had to have a whole week off work after his accident last Monday. Um, he's got a massive bruise on his arm. His cuts are ridiculous on his back. Um, when you take pictures of them and stuff, they don't look like anything. Like, they look sore, but they don't look anything really painful. But believe me, they're quite deep um, for superficial cuts anyway. Um, and the guy who glued him, glued them together, actually glued his uh, dressing to them as well, which means he was really in pain because the dressing was literally just stuck to him. So he had to wait until he could shower. He was told not to shower for five days. And he had to wait until he could shower before he could get the majority of the dressing off. We actually had to cut, well, I cut a lot of it off away from where his wounds were. But he had a week off. Um, he was very achy, very stiff. Um, like I said, he's got a massive bruise on his arm, which I'm sure he's tweeted a picture of. And I was actually considering putting the vlogs on hiatus until after Christmas. Um, just because... As you can tell, Luna's on my lap. Just because getting back into it was really, I was finding it really difficult, or I'm finding it really difficult. And I really, 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 really want to do it. And I think unless your heart's in it, then it's never going to be what you want it to be. But the past couple of days I've been thinking, and I really just don't want, I don't want to wait. I just, I, I need to get back into it now before Christmas. Because if I don't, then I probably won't want to do it again. So. We're back, properly, day to day, boring days and all. So today I look like a mess. I am still in my pyjama top. I've just put a big beanie on my head and I look silly. And my skin is incredibly ridiculous. Um, so yeah, that's me for moaning. Um, so I'm gonna, I've got a blog post to write today. I've got some cleaning to do. I've got some laundry to do. I've got some washing up to do. Just general house cleaning stuff. That's what I'm gonna get done today. And then tomorrow is video filming day for my main channel. Um, I actually did this the other day to plan all the way up until the 29th of December. So hopefully, fingers crossed, I can keep on top of vlog and YouTube. So as long as I can keep on top of vlogs too, what I'm actually going to make myself do, which is what I used to do way, way, way back when I started doing vlogging, is at the end of the night, no matter how crap or tired I feel, because I find if I go to bed quite awake I struggled to sleep that night whereas last night I went to bed and I was incredibly tired I just felt so run down and my eyes were burning and I was that tired and I slept like a log so I've decided that rather than waiting until the next day to edit the vlog I'm going to say film the day and then edit the vlog that night upload before I go to bed so it's ready to go up the next day so I have no excuse because Part of the issue with me at the minute is, I'm, I'm vlogging, I'm recording, this cat is crazy. I'm recording, but then when it comes to the next day, I can't be bothered to edit, and then that is when I miss days, and that is when I just end up not even bothering to vlog. So, I'm going to start doing it nightly again, editing in the evenings, which is what I used to do. So, I'm going to get back into that, I think it will really help. And getting back on top of stuff this week, with Liam being off, we kind of just lazed, did nothing. We really did nothing. We did, I, I honestly can't think of much that we did. I think we went out for lunch one day because I wanted Liam to get out of the house, just to stretch his back and stuff. So I dragged him out for a pub lunch, just... Buggy! Um, so yeah, I dragged him out for a pub lunch, but that was about it. That's all we really did. We have actually purchased a new shower screen. Um, Liam's mum was really nice and bought it for us. I say we purchased it, she purchased it, um, from Homebase. And it turns out it's the exact same one. Um, so it fits into the barrier, the barrier, the, the bracket that was already on the wall, because obviously the bracket wasn't broken, so we could just replace the door. Um, but we need to borrow a drill, which I need to remind him to ask someone at work if they've got a drill. Because at the minute it's in it's in 
the um, bracket and it's quite tight in the bracket but we can't move the door yet because it'll probably just ping straight off so we can have showers without having a, sh a swimming pool bathroom anymore which is good so I'm going to stop rambling I'm going to eat because I haven't really eaten and that's really bad for baby and I'm going to give this cat some fusses because she's like fuss me now she's very cuddly at the minute I don't know whether, it's she, whether she knows there's something going on with me or I don't know but all the animals are very very cuddly mischief is all constantly on my belly Luna is constantly wanting cuddles and Bug slept beside me all morning I've just spent all morning just lazing in bed because I felt good to wake up and not be tired first thing in the morning so I just lazed and watched some YouTube videos and chilled out and now I'm in a good mood to get stuff done so that's good I've been waking up in an awful mood for the past few days so this is a good day good day to start vlogging again good day to start it all properly again good good day good day Luna good day, good day. let's go okay so the dog is going crazy downstairs and I'm pretty sure it's because there was a car across the street with a clamp on it and I don't know how long it had been like that I don't know if it was there last night but it was there when I looked out the window this morning and then I heard all this kerfuffle and I thought what's, what's going on and I looked out there's a big light shining off that car which is like coming from my house but that is not anyway um, that's it's gone now must have been the sun. Um, so yeah, there was a group of lads, probably a bit older than Liam, and, well, probably about Liam's age, with a massive angle grinder, and they were starting up the angle grinder, and they angle grinded this boot off the car, and then just took it off, and then literally just like sped up the road in the car. There was also a tow truck as well. Um, which said on the back, we, we buy cars for cash. So, that's not dodgy at all. I don't know what's going on there. But anywho, I've sorted my blog post out. I have everything prepared for my blog post. I just need to get it written tonight. Um, and now I'm a celebrity's done. I don't have that much to um, actually do in the evenings. Buggy! There's some real noises going on today. <laughs> There's no sign of that car anymore. Um, so I've got this load of washing to hang up and put on the dryer. I've also got another basket downstairs. And then I have bedding to do, but I don't think I can do that until this is dry because Liam spilled hot chocolate all over the bed the other night and I need to get that out of the sheets um, somehow. So, yay for me. I really haven't done much else. I've just done my blog post, which at least that is prepared. I've also lit some candles downstairs because I do like having a nice smelling house. And then I'm going to have a bit of a tidy up up here. Downstairs isn't too bad, it just needs hoovering, which is good. So yeah, that's pretty much how today's going. Not too exciting, I'm afraid. I need to have a shower and sort my face out. And um, yeah, because I feel horrific. I feel like I look like a man. That is how I feel. So I'm going to get on and do this washing because my arm is dying. I can tell I haven't vlogged for a while because my arm's getting tired. So yes, I'm going to keep this cat up the tush too because she's scratching the carpet. So finally done all that hanging up, but I'm going to try and stick this in the washing machine because it's a synthetic pillow, it's not it's not feathers or anything, so I'm going to um, stick that in the washing machine and hope that it gets that out because hot chocolate apparently dries crispy. Mmm, crispy. And then I'm going to tackle this because apparently... We are like the king and queen of washing up, literally. It's like, we do the washing up, two seconds later, it's a mound full of more. So I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna jump in the shower, I think. I think my back's starting to hurt. But let's see if we can wash this pillow. The pillow didn't work. <laughs> Look, oh my God, I'm so blurry. Hold on a minute. Uh oh, I think the spinning in the washing machine broke it. I don't think it's gonna get back to a flat, to a, to a flat, um, um, um. Uh, this may not. Nope. 
I think that's just gonna have to go in the bin. It's clean! But it's not really pillow shaped anymore. Poop. Anywho, I'll let Liam see that one again. Cause we were, we were in an hour last night as whether I should actually stick in the washing machine or just hand wash it. We were like, oh, I'll be all right in the washing machine. And even on the label it says washing machine is fine. But apparently our washing machine is uh, too violent for the old, for the old uh, pillows. So this one's going in the bin. I'm gonna leave it on the top of the fridge for him to see when he gets in. I think he's on his way home soon. Well, I think he's on his way home now. So I'm gonna hop in the shower. I'm just watching an interview with Demi Lovato, which was on in Scotland, I think. So I'm just gonna finish watching that, and then we shall jump in the shower and get clean. And then tonight I'm going to write my blog post and do my nails and do my eyebrows and make myself feel better. And Liam said he's gonna take the dog for a walk, a walk run, a walk run. He wants to start getting fit, fit. He wants his fitness back, so he wants to start running, but he's like me, he hates running in public. And obviously with Christmas and stuff, the gym membership at the minute is a no-no, so after Christmas, I think he's joining a gym. And I have to say that being pregnant has probably given me the biggest kick up the arse ever to want to lose weight, so. I cannot wait as much as you know I'm very much enjoying the fact that I'm pregnant and the outcome is going to be a little bubby but I'm not enjoying the pregnancy <laughs> I feel fat I feel frumpy none of my clothes fit and we can't afford for me to actually go out and splurge and buy some maternity stuff or anything that does fit so I am currently living in pajamas and jogging bottoms and leggings and I feel horrible about it um, so hopefully after Christmas I can do some shopping and buy some stuff that fits. Um, and being overweight to begin with obviously isn't very good. And I'm, I just feel like I'm feeling it a lot more than I would have if I was fit to begin with. So after this baby comes I'm going to get in the best shape of my life. And yeah, I'm actually really looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to having baby and going for walks and stuff like that and just getting active again and feeling good about myself because right now I don't feel good about myself. Liam is probably the best person to tell you how crap I've been feeling. I've been very low. It's probably another reason why I haven't vlogged for the past week. I've been feeling incredibly low and I don't want my depression to become a problem again. I don't know that just dropped his bone. I know that my hormones are obviously going a bit crazy at the minute, but I don't want depression to be a problem again, so I need to sort this out while I can. So, hence, we're going to try and make myself feel a bit better tonight. And yes, so I'm just going to finish watching this interview and jump in the shower before he gets in. It looks like daddy's home. And he's not taking him for a run. <laughs> and I've had a shower. <laughs> Get off me! What are you doing? Look at that tail! Get off me! <laughs> <laughs> this is no. too funny to help. No more. Oh, no, it's like it's like that tongue's just like led me at him. <laughs> oh, dinky. How's your bruise today? It's better. Let me see. Mm, yes, it's getting better. It doesn't better. say JFK anymore. <laughs> it's losing its Hi. colour now. Hi. It could have said Jeff, actually, I realised. <laughs> Jeff the bruise. Buggy, did Daddy say he was going to take you for a run? He did, didn't he? Oh. Ow. I don't think. Ow! We have sharp claws on my very I thin don't leggings. Think you have a receipt. Oh no! <laughs> his face! Just a little smile when he's scratching, which is mouth. Oh, in other news, we think we've beaten the fleas. With, get it, 
the one pound flea collars we got from the pound shop. Because we haven't seen, like, I, I was thinking this morning, we haven't seen a flea on him for no. about a week and a half, two weeks no. since we put them on. And this morning, one fell off him, dead. It was like, it just fell out of his fur, where, where, like, where I was scratching him. Bleh. Yeah. So, I think, he's still itching, but he's still healing his sore bits. So I guess he's in, a, in an itch-scratch cycle, but... Look at that face. Thumbnails. Doggy! Come here! <laughs> Those oh. things, those things right there are going in January. Yes. They freak me out. Te Bugs testicles freak you out. Mm-hmm. Because they're, they're big and wiggly and they're always staring at me. They're big yeah, and they're wiggly and they're always doing wiggly. It feels so much later than, what, half past four? We're going to chop them bug release balls. I know. It's ten past five, so it is a little bit later. Oh, why you slapped me? Ooh, it was the dog. That was fast! Make sure I did work. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> My mouth! <laughs> That's cheating, you cheaty cheat. Uh. I've got a scratch on my face. Oh. You jumped on my face like I want the boot. <laughs> now you know how no. I felt when he kicked me in the face. Do you remember when he kicked me in the face? Right at the beginning of the vlog. Yeah, but I didn't cry about it. I didn't cry about it then either. <laughs> Douche. Oh, what's this? That's your phone. It looked, hey. it looked like some kind of packaging. <laughs> no. Oops. Bookster. <laughs> no. Yum. I always catch you stuff in your face. Mm. No. No. Is it good? Godzilla? Is he even bigger?